love you. You hurt my feelings. I'm not okay with that. I'm sorry. What do all of these statements have in common? Well, for one, they suck to admit. It's uncomfortable, it's honest, and it's vulnerable. Happy Wednesday. Welcome to the Daily Huddle with me, Life Coach Franzani. All week long, we've been talking about how to live an authentic life. And vulnerability is the second step to living authentically. Yesterday, we talked about defining who you are. And for your homework, I challenged you to take your negative labels and turn them into strengths. And that's because our greatest strengths also are our greatest weaknesses. So for me, I shared that I had the label mean and I turned it into my gift for challenging people. So that's where it stems from. Well, raise your hand if you like to be challenged. And if you raised your hand, you're either like a coach or you're into personal development or you're just lying because most people don't, right? So my gift for challenging people, especially those closest to me, comes at comes with a lot of pushback. So a huge expense typically for me. And sometimes I feel like shit afterwards. And honestly, I don't always get it right. And I do end up being mean. Even the seemingly good parts of our personalities can be uncomfortable. One of the favorite things I shared about myself was that I'm empathetic. But do you know how my empathy shows up? happy tears, sad tears, confused tears, angry tears, lots of tears, and I hate crying while simultaneously loving how big my emotions are. Expressing yourself is a good, bad, and ugly practice of vulnerability, but the opposite of vulnerability is guarded and closed. And guarding who you are and closing yourself off to the world or to the people around you is not the way to live authentically. So where are you guarding yourself? Who are you guarding yourself with? Where are you, where or who are you closed off to? And look at those situations and I challenge how fulfilled are you in those situations? My bet is that you feel everything but happy and fulfilled in the situations or with the people that you need to close yourself off to or be guarded around. So how can you be more authentic? AKA, how can you dive into your discomfort and express your true self and be seen? Because you deserve to be seen. So that's all I've got for you today. Thank you so much for tuning in to the Daily Huddle with me, Life Coach Franzani. Every week I pick a theme and every day we discuss a topic in that theme all around better every day because we don't hope to have a good life. We work to live our very best lives. See, I'm challenging you right there. I'll see you here bright and early tomorrow morning to continue our discussion on living authentically. Give yourself an amazing day.